Good. How hard is Sarah's Day's ebook? I feel like it's not like the first, first, first exercise, your legs will be dead for like three days after that, but after that, it's pretty smooth sailing. You're just gonna like motivate yourself to do it. Hey, Emma. Yeah. Will you get a dog when you're older? Yeah, I wanna get one like next year when we go flatting. Hey, Emma. Yes. What do you see yourself doing in 10 years? Um, starting a family, being married, probably own a house by then. Um, working in my dream job, but I don't know what my dream job is. You don't know what your dream job is? Well, like something to do with like marketing, like maybe working in like a big business and a team, or working for myself, but I don't know what the job would be. Like, I couldn't make a whole business out of like merch, but yeah. Hey, Emma. What's your least favorite flavor of chips? Probably chicken. Already salted because really salted is as boring as. Hey Emma, do you have any TV show recommendations? Um, I don't know. Oh, Boss Babes on TV and Z on Demand. Good show. Yes. What are your fave pieces from Sarah's new reboot acting <laughs> recollection and which ones <laughs> will you buy? Well, you see, the thing is. I was going to buy the white crop and the jumper with the stripes down. I can't remember the name of the stripes down here. Put my put the both of my cart was good to go right at one o'clock when they went live in New Zealand. And anyway, I put one digit wrong in my card in the thing and it declined. So I went to redo it and then the white one was sold white t-shirt was sold out. I was like, oh okay. Well Rachel was like, are you gonna buy the jumper? And I was like, mm, maybe. And then I was too I was having a sulk and then I missed out on both. Any advice about friends developing in different ways, e.g. alcohol? Um, friends are friends, so if they disrespect you for like your, like whether you want to drink alcohol or not, that's a whole different thing. I would say if they're putting you down for not drinking alcohol, if that's kind of what you're meaning, then I wouldn't say that those are true friends because your true friends should support you and love what, well, not necessarily love what you love, but support what you support. And don't feel peer pressured into doing something that you don't want to do because peer pressure is a cruel thing. Um, especially in teenage years, it's very prominent and it's important that you still remain like yourself and support your own morals. Yes. Where is somewhere that you've been to in the South Island of New Zealand? Somewhere or everywhere? Because I've been to Christchurch. Hang on, let me get a map up. Just give me a second. Christchurch, Akaroa, Kaikoura, Blenheim, Nelson, Mochueka, Collingwood, Farewell Spit, Westport, Greymouth, Arthur's Pass, Hookatika, Fox Glacier, Franz Joseph Glacier, Queenstown, Haast, Jackson Bay, Lenorke, Cromwell, Arrowtown, Milford Sound, Doubtful Sound, Dunedin, Invercargill, Bluff. Okay, so you've been everywhere. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> yes. What's your favourite book in the Bible? I don't know. I actually don't know. I feel like a lot of stuff in this last week particularly has been coming up from Genesis and it's been like pretty good words of wisdom. Um, but I mean, Matthew always has, or Psalms, because uh, Psalms are all songs, are they? Like little hymns. Is that true? I think so. Yeah. Well, there we go. Huh? Yeah. Did you ever play sports? I played netball and I did orienteering. Netball I wasn't so flash at, orienteering I was... Not the flex, but I was pretty good national champion. And I also did indoor bowls, which I was also like a regional champion at. Hey Emma, do you see yourself doing YouTube for a long time? Um, probably. Like when I had kids, it may be a different story, but like I don't imagine myself stopping anytime soon. Emma, yes. do you ever get bullied for your skin condition? When it's particularly bad, like last year it flared up and that started this year. I didn't get bullied as such, but I just get people asking a lot of questions in a way that wasn't super respectful, if that makes sense. Hey Emma, do you have any tips for like people in high school, like in year 9, 10, 11, 12 and 13? Like just broad tips? Just tips. Um, high school, once you get to university, you realise how much it, like it matters, but not as much as you probably thought it did. But try as hard as you can and don't beat yourself up. If you go into a test right and you're a bit confused, you only know as much as you can, you only know as much as you know. So if you don't know something, don't sweat about it. Just, it'll be fine. What do you do when you don't feel motivated? 
I normally give myself because obviously I'm feeling unmotivated, unmotivated for a reason. So I give myself like a little bit of time to do what I want to do and give myself some me time. And then I give myself a time, and at that time, like say half an hour later, I have to pick up my book, pick up my laptop, and just do whatever I'm procrastinating. Hey, Matt. <laughs> What's the hardest thing about university? Um, time management because there's a lot of work to do. What's your favorite food? Oh, look at the cookies. Um, um, probably anything Japanese, but probably sushi. Hey Emma, would you consider yourself an introvert or an extrovert? Can I have your help with this question? What would you consider me as? I reckon introvert. I would say both. Yeah. I would say... Like once you get to know me, I'm definitely extrovert. I like, reckon you're an introvert, but then you have like little... Extrovert, like personality traits. that makes sense. And someone actually commented, you're a big introvert with hints of extrovert. That person apparently knows me very well then. Hey Emma. Yes. What are your goals for your channel this year? Um, I would like to get past like 39k because I've been stuck there for so long. Not that it's bad because like I was saying right last night, you guys, there's 39,000 people so supportive, but it'd be nice to like have a few new people join on board and just to keep on putting out content weekly that is that you guys enjoy. Hey Emma! Yes. How many kids do you want to have? Three. Probably. Hey Emma! <laughs> yeah. Who's your favourite person that starts with M? Mum. <laughs> hey Emma! What's your favourite holiday destination? Fongmata for the Hey Emma! Does it sometimes feel like your hard work doesn't pay off? Yes, but then I just have to remind myself that. Everyone who's watching this video right now is incredibly supportive and I would be able to be here, sit here doing this right now if it weren't for you guys. So, yeah. Thank you. Hey Emma, what age do you want to be married? I would say like, okay, so I'm 18, I will graduate uni when I'm 20 and I would like to be married around 22, 23. What is the first thing you want to do when isolation fully goes back to normal? Go to church. Like, properly go to church. Uh, <laughs> oh, are you guys doing a Q and A? Yeah. She's asking me just like questions, like she's been asking me random questions at random times over the last like 48 hours or 24 hours. That would be a good compilation. Yes. What's the best and worst thing about university? Best thing would be learning about stuff that you actually care about. And worst thing would be the readings. How did you and Owen meet? <sighs> so, um, long story short, we had mutual friends and we knew of each other and followed each other on Instagram but didn't talk. And then he slid into my chats on Snapchat. I freaked out. I kind of knew who, uh, I knew who he was. I knew that he was like really attractive. And then we've talked every day ever since. <laughs> yes, Rachel. What's your favourite New Zealand snack? Squiggles. Hey Emma. Mm -hmm. What's your favourite ice cream flavour? Oh, um, cookie dough. What's the best TV show you watched as a child? Good luck, Charlie. Hey Emma. Yes. What are three things that have made you smile today? Surprising Liam with we had to like do a secret admirers thing and we had to like surprise him with some music and stuff for a secret admirer. Um, I got a really cool brand deal today secured and spending the day with Rachel's been pretty cool. That makes me smile. Aww. Hey Emma. Yes. What is your biggest fear in life? Ooh. Probably people not understanding me for who I am. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Hey Emma. Yes. What was your parents' first impression of Owen? When he left my, because he met my parents the same day he met me, and when he left my house, my mum, the first thing my mum said is, he has braces. <laughs> hey Emma. Was it easy making friends at university? Yes. Rachel just, she's my neighbour, and we just went to dinner the first night together, and the rest is history. Hey Emma. Yes. Do you believe in quantity or quality of friends? Quality. 
110% quality. Why? Because, like, you could have, like, a million friends, but if they don't care about you, do you really have any friends? True. Just some food for thought. Hey, Miss. <laughs> yes. Do you love being busy? Yes. Hey, Emma. Yes. What's your biggest worry right now? Um, my assignment is due on Friday. Emma? Yes. Do you like olives? No. Hey, Emma. Yes. What was your favorite year at high school? Year 10 or year 12. Hey, Emma. Yes. Are you going flatting next year? I am, and Rachel behind the camera is going to be one of my flatmates. Besides Liam, who is your favourite RA? Janelle. <laughs> What's your biggest pet peeve? Slow walkers. <laughs> hey Emma, if you had to meet one person that you look up to, who would it be? Sarah's Day. Do you have any new merch coming out soon? I do. That is true, but secrets until it actually comes out. Hey Emma, what is a place you would like to travel to? Anfield Stadium to watch Liverpool play. Oh. What is your favourite fast food restaurant? Burger Fuel. Hey Emma, final question. Yes. How do you make someone smile? You do this and then it makes someone smile. So rude! Hey Emma, do you sell? <laughs> Do when you don't. <laughs> hey, man. Hang on. <laughs> There's guy in the blue. Bin. No, 